We interrupt our programming to bring you the following special report. The Ryan Report. Whatever, Whatever opinion they had, ain't gonna change nothing I'm doing. What was the story he told? Because I, I was there. It's time for the Ryan Report. It's like Jay-Z, all eyes on us. On the People Station, V103. It is your Ryan Report. It's being brought to you by McDonald's. Get two of your faves from the McDonald's Mac Pick Two menu. A Mac Chicken, a Mac Double, a six piece chicken McNuggets, or small fries. Two of these for $2.50 at participating restaurants. I'm loving it. All right, then, go Shay. 717 right now. Do you watch uh, The Real Housewives? Absolutely. So. You know this whole thing between Peter and Cynthia? Yeah. You know, uh, Cynthia was on earlier this week. Uh, the next day it came out that, you know, that she was going to file for divorce. Now Peter uh, says he's deeply saddened. According to him, he said he thought they were in this together. He says, I have never cheated on her. I've never taken money from her. <laughs> um, Peter says... We have discussed divorce. It wasn't something that I wanted, but it is something that I believe she thinks she needs. And honestly, I wish we could have made the public announcement jointly. I love Cynthia, and I've never cheated on her. She knows this. I've never taken money from Cynthia. She knows this. I haven't done anything but love and defend my wife. She knows this, too. Mm. I mean, I've watched The Housewives, so I've seen on several occasions the money struggle back and forth that Peter has taken from Cynthia or right. used for different business ideas. Mm-hmm. So I don't believe the money part, the cheating part. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if he hasn't cheated, he sure does look very suspicious. Mm, okay. All right. But I thought they had already agreed to have a divorce, so I thought they probably would have been at the end of this. Does he have a problem with the way that she talked about it? Because it was on like extra or something like that. You know, he said they they wanted to come together and make a joint statement. But well, you know, I guess he just wants to get his side out. Mm, Okay. But I thought they had already decided this at the end of the season of last season. That's what I thought. She says it is real. It's not a you know a a uh, a show storyline that. You know, she had to relive it because it's happening in real life. Mm-hmm. All right. Also happening in real life, Beyonce on uh, her social media talking about, you know, all the things that are going on in the country. Mm-hmm. She makes a post. We are sick and tired of the killings of young men and women in our communities. It is up to us to take a stand and demand that they stop killing us. We don't need sympathy. We need everyone to respect our lives. We're going to stand up as a community and fight against anyone who believes that murder of any violent action is those of those who are sworn to protect us should consistently go unpunished. And she goes on and on on all of her different sites saying this is not a plea to all police officers, but toward any uh, human being who fails to value life. The war on people of color and of all minorities needs to be over. Fear is not an exercise. Hate will not win. So Beyonce taking a, you know, you don't you don't have any doubt about how she feels about it. I mean, she's the queen. Yeah. So definitely, I think it's important for her to take a stand on this matter because it's very important that celebrities get involved. You Seven know. nineteen right now. And last but not least, if you know the words, well, the letters BMF, then you know that means Black Mafia Family. Mm. Fifty Cent says it's about to be a, a TV show. Oh. A BMF. TV show. He's a part of BMF? No, no. See, go shot and not say nothing like this. Oh, okay. He is going to <laughs> produce a BMF TV show. <laughs> and of course, Atlanta knows very well all about Big Meech and BMF. Absolutely. So, we'll see how he plans to uh, tell the story. Hmm. He just sent out, you know, basically uh, an Instagram post yesterday saying, this TV series is going to blow you away. So, there you go. He's always doing something. He's he's doing something. Can't wait for power to come back. Exactly. 720 right now. And that is your Ryan Report right here on the People Station. It's V103. And if you don't know, now you know, you know, you know. The Ryan Report. The Ryan Report. V103.